Why didn't you tell me what had happened? I've a right to know Rona's still bullying my son. Jamie asked me not to. He was worried you might get upset. Dare I even ask how you intend to act on this information? She's about to find out. I was so sorry to hear about Pete. I know we've had our issues, but I know how much you loved him. And, well, breakups never easy. And next time some embryo dumps you, take it out on me, not my son. Your hands off me. Oh, are they fighting? What did you expect when you threatened Jamie? I have a right to intervene if I think an employee is underperforming. He's not. Only partners are guaranteed jobs, Kim. You signed that deal. You agreed it. And it says you're not a partner. You've no rights. I have all the others backing me. You're just bitter. Pete left you. You know, men are like fires. Leave them unattended, they go out. Well, he refused to poke your rusty old grate. I own 25% of that business. That says stop sulking about your love life and leave my son alone. You think insults will work? I'm willing to try a hard slap instead. <laughs> Maybe we, um, calm this down, hmm? Thank you. Maybe, uh, listen to Will. Yeah, Kim. Why don't you listen to your little pet? Oh, I can't a man just enjoy a cuppa in peace. A little Wild West brawls next week. Shut up, Jimmy. Do you know what? I'm off, because this is over. You really think you call the shots? You've no power. Oh, I've all the power, Kim. The one who has none is Jamie, which is about to find out. <laughs>